Hi, welcome to our brand new Microsoft Azure Fundamental AZ900 Practice Questions 2022. In this video, we are going to discuss all the dummy questions of the Microsoft AZ900 exam. I am your host Neetu Rai from UpDegree. And let's get started. Question 106. Select yes or no for the following statement. Is it possible to manage external partners using the business-to-business -business B2B feature of Azure AD? Now the options are Option A, yes. Option B, no. And the correct answer is Option A, yes. Explanation With Azure AD, you can manage external partners while maintaining control over your own corporate data. Question 107 Choose the appropriate category for the following Azure services. Azure Kubernetes Business Intelligence BI Services. Now the options are Option A. Software as a Service Option B. Platform as a Service Option C. Infrastructure as a Service Option D. Hardware as a Service And the correct answer is Option B. Platform as a Service Explanation Kubernetes and BI services come under the Platform as a Service category. Question 108 a company wants to make use of Azure Service Health. Is it possible for the company administrator to prevent service failures from affecting a selected Azure virtual machine by only using the service? Now the options are Option A. Yes. Option B. No. And the correct answer is Option B. No. Explanation The Azure Service Health service is used to monitor the health of the underlying infrastructure that is used to host Azure-based services. You cannot use this service to prevent the service failure of an Azure virtual machine. If you want to increase the availability of your virtual machines, consider deploying the virtual machines across an availability set or an availability zone. Question 109. How many minutes per month downtime is 99.99% availability? Now the options are Option A. 1. Option B. 4. Option C. 100. Option D. 40. And the correct answer is Option B. 4. Question 110. Which style of computing is easiest when migrating an existing hosted application from your own data center into the cloud? Now, the options are Option A. IaaS. Option B. PaaS. Option C. FaaS. Option D, serverless. And the correct answer is option A, IaaS. Explanation. Infrastructure as a service is the easiest to migrate into from an existing hosted app lift and shift. Question 111. Fill in the blanks. Dash allows you to use your own domain names for your internal private Azure virtual machines. Now the options are option A, Azure DNS private zones. Option B, Azure Bastion Option C Azure Traffic Manager Option D Azure Load Balancer And the correct answer is Option A Azure DNS Private Zones Explanation Azure DNS Private Zones provide a simple, reliable, secure DNS service to manage and resolve names in a virtual network without the need to create and manage a custom DNS solution. Use your own domain names and get name resolution for virtual machines within and between virtual networks. Additionally, configure zone names with a split horizon view to allow a private and a public DNS zone to share the same name. Question 112. You are planning to set up a solution on the Azure platform. The solution has the following key requirement. Provide capabilities to perform big data analytics over data stored on Azure blob storage. Which of the following would be best suited for this requirement? Now the options are Option A. Azure Data Lake Storage Option B. Azure Application Gateway Option C. Azure Storage Accounts Option D. Azure SQL Data Warehouse And the correct answer is Option A. Azure Data Lake Storage Explanation This can be achieved by the Azure Data Lake Storage Service. Azure Data Lake is a cloud platform designed to support big data analytics. It provides unlimited storage for structured, semi-structured or unstructured data. 
It can be used to store any type of data of any size. Question 113. Select yes or no. For the following statement, does the Cosmos DB service provide the ability to access data using different types of APIs such as MongoDB and Cassandra? Now the options are Option A, yes. Option B, no. And the correct answer is Option A, yes. Explanation Cosmos DB is a multi-model database. The Azure Cosmos DB Cassandra API is compatible with Cassandra query language. The Azure Cosmos DB API for MongoDB makes it easy to use Cosmos DB as if it were a MongoDB database. You can leverage your MongoDB experience and continue to use your favorite MongoDB drivers, SDKs and tools by pointing your application to the API for MongoDB accounts connection string. Question 114. Select yes or no. For the following statement, a company decided to store application-related user data in the Azure file service. Is this the ideal service for the storage of user-related data? Now, the options are Option A, yes. Option B, no. And the correct answer is Option B, no. Explanation No, file service is not the right option. Azure file service, also known as Azure Files, is a part of the Microsoft Azure Cloud Platform that allows organizations to share files on-premises and in the cloud using server, message block, SMB, protocol, and APIs. Question 115. You have defined an Azure Virtual Network in a resource group. Now, you intend to assign a policy that specifies that virtual networks are not an allowed resource type in the resource group. Once the policy is applied, what happens to the existing network? Now the options are Option A. The network is automatically deleted. Option B. The network is moved to a different resource group. Option C. The network resources would become a read-only resource. Option D. The virtual network would continue to exist as it is. And the correct answer is Option D. The virtual network would continue to exist as it is. Explanation the virtual network would continue to exist as it is, but Azure policies would show the resources as non-compliant resources. Question 116. Select yes or no. For the following statement, does Azure Active Directory provide authentication services for services hosted in Azure and Microsoft Office 365? Now, the options are Option A, yes. Option B, no. And the correct answer is option A, yes. Explanation. You can use Azure Active Directory to authenticate to both Azure-based resources and also to Microsoft Office 365. Question 117. A company currently has the following unused resources as part of its premium subscription. 10 user accounts in Azure AD. 5 user groups in Azure AD. 10 public IP address. 10 network interfaces. They want to reduce the cost for resources hosted in Azure. They decide to remove the user accounts from Azure AD. Would this meet the requirement? Now the options are Option A, yes. Option B, no. And the correct answer is Option B, no. Explanation When you look at the pricing for Azure Active Directory, you can create 50,000 objects as part of the free version. These objects include both users and groups. For the premium subscription, there are no object limits. Question 118. A company is planning to deploy a web application to the Azure App Service. Would the company administrative team have full control over the underlying machine hosting the web application? Now the options are Option A, yes. Option B, no. And the correct answer is Option B, no. Explanation. The Azure Web App Service is a platform as a service. Here, the underlying infrastructure is completely managed by Azure. Question 119. You need to create a virtual machine in Azure. You are using a Windows desktop along with the Azure command line interface. Which of the following would let you use the Azure command line interface? Select two options. Now, the options are Option A, PowerShell. Option B, File and Print Explorer. Option C, Command Prompt. 
ऑप्शन डी कंट्रोल पैनल एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए पावर शेल एंड ऑप्शन सी कमांड प्रॉम्प्ट एक्सप्लेनेशन यू कैन लॉन्च द अज्योर कमांड लाइन इंटरफेस फ्रॉम द कमांड प्रॉम्प्ट और पावर शेल क्वेश्चन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी सेलेक्ट येस और नो फॉर द बेलो स्टेटमेंट अ कंपनी इज प्लानिंग टू सेट अप एन अज्योर फ्री अकाउंट Does the standard support plan come along with the Azure free account? Now the options are: option A, yes; option B, no; and the correct answer is option B, no. Explanation: The basic support plan is the default one, which is associated with all Azure accounts. In order to have a standard support plan, it needs to be purchased. Thank you for watching this video. Please do not forget to like this video and. Subscribe to our channel by our AZ 900 premium questions with 50% off. Check link in the description.